And now our tail of the tape for this lightweight scrap. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Ready to fight. Ready. Good. All right, here he is, the founding father of modern MMA, Bruce Lee, ready to go for round one. The speed and the angles just absurd, and a hard guy to simulate in training. You think he got a beat on him, and then you end up twitching on the canvas. So we'll see how the opponent chooses to defend Bruce Lee here in the early go. Lands a big right hand early. Roundhouse kick lands. Huge kick lands again. Oh, he did a great job of rotating him into an underhook. Now some uppercuts. He better move, John. He cannot take these uppercuts from this position. Oh, nice jab there by your dog. See if he can follow it up. Very traditional technique that a lot of guys are using out in the Wow, strong roundhouse kick there. So the hammer's an effective punch there, and at least in that situation, it paid to have the advantage in reach. Overhand left. It's so clear that the guy that's going forward is the guy that's successful. Tried to go to the... Oh! They continue to exchange. Oh, late defense on the takedown and scrambles to his feet. Nicely done. There's a kick. Just over three minutes to go round one. Beautiful right punch. Follows it up with the left. Oh, brutal knee to the body. All right, so an opportunity goes by the boards. He had him stunned, nearly finished, and now his opponent has won the cover. Now he's got to deal with everything that he's going to bring at him. He should have got the fight finished at that point. Oh, big hook. That'll sting. Now they're both throwing the power. Oh, with authority, the body. Another nice kick there. Solid series of kicks. They're all landing now. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment. Yes. There it is again. Look at that. Man. Knee to the body. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Well, I'm not sure if I should knock his fight IQ, but it seems like he's sort of playing around here. It feels like the finish is there for the taking. Yeah, the finish is there. And he needs to take his time to try and find it. Don't rush. Be patient. And in that patience, you'll find a punch or kick that will put your opponent out. All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He was taking shots too clean. And now a cut is opened up. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Rips the body there for good measure. These boys are standing right in front of each other, just kind of going at it. Oh, and he caught the kick. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Hook to the head there by the gun. Well, as soon as he goes with that high guard, he pays for it to the body. You see the bruises really starting to accumulate now. In the beginning of the fight, you think, I got to protect the head. Right now, I believe that this guy has to worry about his body. Look at how red the side of his body is. It's got to change something. All right, so again, he shoots for a takedown here. Looks like he entered pretty well, but 
once again not able to take the opposition. Just a great idea of what was in front of him by the opponent. Knew that he would have to defend multiple takedowns to this point. He has done that, and if I'm a teacher, he's got an A-plus to take down Another strike hits that eye area, and it is getting messier by the minute up there. Well, he's getting targeted now. He's been hitting that spot so many times that his opponent sees the cut, and the cut is advancing. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their... Oh! Mixes in an elbow for good measure! All right, there's the horn, and what a round it was for him, DC. And look at him walking back to that corner. He's feeling himself a little bit. Oh, he's feeling himself. And look at his coaches. They're all celebrating because they know that if they stay the course, if they do the exact same thing, they may be able to find the finish this time. All right, so a big knockdown in that last round. DC will show you the replay. Nearly had him out of there. He almost had him out. He had him gone. He hurt him real bad. He thought the fight was over. But the night will go on. The dance continues. Will this be the final dance? You ready to fight? Ready. All right, second round underway. All right, doing work with the jab. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to half length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Oh, nice inside kick. Oh, clean hook there. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure, and he has certainly kept up his end of the day. I mean, the cardio is fantastic tonight. He is pushing at a level that we have not seen him fight before. This is shades of Kobe Covington, Max Holloway, those guys that can fight all night. He is showing you that he has done the work in the training room, and it's on full display tonight. Oh, man, he's still targeting that cut, and it is getting worse by the minute. He will let his opponent stand up here. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Oh, he's wearing it now, bleeding from his cheek. Feels like the beginning of the end. Oh, that was a big one there. All right, so another swing and a miss. And I'd imagine if your gas tank is this low, you got to find times to try to preserve that energy and, and get yourself back to a place where you can actually dole out some damage. Yeah, you got to get out to space, find places to rest and recover, get against the octagon, go to the clinch, find ways to just recover so that when you have that next explosion, it actually has some meaning to it. Well, no feeling out process tonight. Both fighters invoking damage on the other side. Yeah, we knew this would be very competitive. We knew that this was a tough fight. We knew that both guys would be very evenly matched in this fight. But we didn't expect to see this type of war between these two guys. Oh, man, the blood is flowing now. That, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or respectfully. Oh, oh, oh my God! Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. All right, let's get it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop in this contest at two minutes, 28 seconds of round number two. Playing the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. 
So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. This man, of course, has had no shortage of 